skies and we are dry. I'm not tracking any showers. We have winds out of the north northwest at 13 miles per hour, so it is breezy at the moment and temperatures are going to continue to go down as we go through the remainder of your evening. So right now, here's a look at a few more temperatures. 52 in Slidell, 53 in Kenner and 54 degrees in Bell Chase and clouds will remain pretty stubborn as we go through tonight. We'll see a little bit of sunshine as we head into tomorrow. So the winds across the area, we are picking up on wind gust readings of 28 miles per hour at the Lakefront Airport, 25 out in Kenner and 21 in Galliano. Things staying breezy as we head into tonight and also tomorrow afternoon. So here's the setup as we take a look at the radar and satellite. Plenty of clouds across the area. We are dry. Here's that first cold front that moved through yesterday that brought that widespread rain, pockets of heavy rain. This second front is not going to necessarily bring us rain, but it is going to bring much colder air as we head into tomorrow and especially tomorrow night. As we take you through the next 12 hours, temperatures will stay steady in the 50s. We're looking at 40s and then eventually lower 40s to begin our Sunday morning. So here's a look at your overnight temperatures tomorrow. Temperatures falling into the 30s north of Lake Pontchartrain. We will be in the lower to mid 40s south of the lake. So here's Monday morning. Many spots will fall below freezing. That really is just confined over our North Shore areas and also west of Lake Pontchartrain. I do think south of the lake we will remain above freezing. And then look at this as we head into Tuesday. It's still going to be a chilly start to our morning, but we will remain above freezing. Now Sunday night into Monday morning, a freeze warning will go into effect for the highlighted parishes. That means temperatures will fall into the upper 20s and lower 30s. So if you have any plants outside, cover them up. Again, this is tomorrow night or bring them inside if you can definitely bring in the pets check on your neighbors pipes will be fine and if you're using any heaters use them with caution so as we look at tomorrow's highs once again we will be below average with our temperatures climbing into the lower to mid 50s across the area so it is going to be a chilly and also breezy day. So taking through the overnight hours, clouds will remain in place, but we'll see some clearing tomorrow, starting off with some sunshine, but then clouds will move in once again. So I expect uh, partly cloudy skies. And then as we head into your Sunday evening, remaining dry if you have any plans. So here's a look at your seven day forecast, and I do wanna walk you through this. So tomorrow, 54 degrees, we'll see a little bit of sunshine and also remaining breezy. As we head into your Sunday night into Monday morning, frost likely north and west of the lake. Temperatures will fall into the upper 20s and lower 30s, and then we'll be in the lower 40s on the south shore. And also Monday is the first day of spring, and it certainly won't feel like it with our daytime highs climbing into the upper 50s. Tuesday looks fantastic. We'll be in the lower 70s, partly cloudy skies, and then things will warm up quickly as we go through midweek. Upper 70s on Wednesday, mostly sunny conditions. We'll ba we're back in the 80s on Thursday, and then another cold front heads our way Friday, and some showers and storms are possible.